Hi traders, the Brexit hit the market. S&P 500 crashed by 3.6% on Friday, driving the market down by 1.6% for the week and 2016 to red territory. Will the crash continue? The big question, of course. Well, not likely. The Brexit is a slow process. It may take years. The influence on the stock market, the US stock market, is probably not going to be that high. However, we need to consider the fact that the British pound is now declining and that will hurt the US economy, but it is a slow process and it will probably take years. So in fact, the Brexit may not be an influence at all on the US market. Now, I do not expect the market to pull back from here. We will continue. There is some small panic in the markets. So I do expect a continuation of approximately three to 5%, but again, I'm not anticipating any crash. Now we also need to remember this is the end of the quarterly season which means institutional traders are likely to buy at this point or at least hold the market. So I do consider the fact that the market is downtrending and it should continue but I do not expect any panic. Let's take a look at the technical view of the market. When you take a look at the S&P 500 daily we can see that the market moved down exactly to the point of support. I do expect it to be broken down, meaning the market should continue moving down. But again, I do not expect a crash. Let's take a look at last week picks. We had two picks last week. First one, CCI did well, although the market moved down. One of the few stocks that in fact moved up, did not reach my 3% target, but did almost uh, 3%, 2.7. And I hope that um, we're going to see some continuation this week. Now, the second pick, AEP, also one of the rare stocks that did move up, did not reach um, more than 0.8%. So I'm still looking for a continuation, but it is doing well. Let's have two picks for this week. My picks for this week are both financial companies. The market should continue moving down. However, financial stocks are very are getting hit very strongly. So the first one to short would be MS Morgan Stanley for short under $24.23. And the second one is Goldman Sachs under $140.92. I wish you a great trading week and see you next week.